Good morning. I hope that everyone has completed the first four sections of the class. You should have completed all the work for exam one by now. If you're having difficulty at any time during the semester, please don't hesitate to contact me. I'd be more than happy to help you. Uh, remember that you do have open office hours and open chat hours if you do need extra help. This week starts section two of the class. It's all about how math can affect or be applied to graphic arts. How does it affect us as graphic designers? Uh, this week, the first thing that you should be working on is the resolution and image size lecture. You'll notice that when you log on, there's a slideshow. I'm going to go through the slideshow with you today. There's also a zipped file for test images. I'd like you to click that and download it. It will download three files, basketball.jpg, net.jpg, and bike.jpg. Uh, make sure you have them. We're going to open them in Photoshop. Um, if you don't have Photoshop, it's not a huge deal. You can still apply the, the principles that we're going to learn. You'll just have to do the math by hand as opposed to letting Photoshop do the math for you. Speaking of doing the math, um, you are not allowed to use a calculator on the first exam, but you can use a calculator from this lecture forward. Uh, we've practiced doing our basic math, now we're going to start applying it. So you don't have to spend time doing long division, you can use the calculator to do that. Once you have downloaded the slideshow and the zipped file, I'd like you to play video number two.